Welcome to another edition of English Makes No Sense, right here on the YouTube channel of the same name, English Makes No Sense. My name is S.L. Rockfish, and today we're going to take a look at another phrasal verb. You remember phrasal verbs. Phrasal verbs are a type of speech that we take a verb and usually a preposition, put them together and create a whole new meaning. Today's phrasal verb is pass out. Pass out. What does that mean? Pass out has two, count them, two meanings. Pass out means to faint. Whew, I'm going to pass out from this heat. Whew, don't pass out. Then pass out means to share or give things to others. For example, the teacher is going to pass out the homework. She's going to give each person the homework. Oh, no, not homework. Yeah, pass out. Pass out to faint. Pass out to share or give things to others. You could pass out cookies. You could pass out treats. You can pass out a lot of things, but you don't want to pass out. Whew, faint. Why does English have two different meanings for one phrasal verb made of the same two words? I don't know, but now you can read and understand this sentence, I hope. Many students felt like they were going to pass out as the teacher passed out the exams. What? Come on, English. Do it one more time. Are you ready? Many students felt like they were going to pass out as the teacher passed out the exams. Come on, English. Can you make a sentence with pass out? Leave it in the comments. Peace, friends.